So we're at the Tonino Market in Tonino, Washington. Um, we're on our way to go look at puppies and we're gonna go pee and eat food, so bye. <laughs> We're leaving and we're on our way back and it's like a two hour trip, so video montage. <laughs> home and so am I but I'm leaving immediately to go pick up my brother from my mom's house because he had school today and I don't ha and um yep so see you later bye so I'm at school right now and I'm eating lunch in the staff room because I don't have class and I got hungry so I left the room I was in and I'm eating lunch with Madison and she's eating a mighty bowl and I'm eating soup with avocado and it's delicious and it has lime and cilantro and I'm excited and <sighs> This little kid is um, annoying and says a lot of curse words. Like, and his mom bought a sweatshirt and shoes and rock revival jeans. Oh, and he says he's 16. Yeah, he's trying to tell us he's 16 and just tried to explain driver's ed to us. And he couldn't even remember what it was called. So now he's gonna come say, say some curse words. What's up, Dylan? You're not 16 because I'm 16. <laughs> if you're 16, how old am I? I don't know, Did your mom pay for that shirt? With what money? With what money? My money. Where'd you get it? <laughs> What's your occupation? <laughs> Can you please do me a favor? Define occupation. Can you define communism? Spelling bee. Velociraptor. <laughs> Can
could you actually spell an English word for me? <laughs> no, what, what, what year were you born? What year? 1975? Yeah. 1975. No. You're old enough to be my dad. And I think you're probably eight. It is about to say, is your mom here? <laughs> <laughs> is Ashley your sister? Is she chaperoning you? Ashley's the one that was here? Yeah. No. Is that your mom? No. Is she chaperoning you? <clears throat> is it your babysitter? Did she get paid to be near you? Is it your recess aide? Probably a recess aide. Did you see her around recess? Did she give you juice boxes? <laughs> <laughs> what? What? Why did you zoom in? I zoomed out, homie. Oh, you got like the high tech phone right there. Not no female. I said, what generation are you? He said, no. What year are you going to graduate and can you count that high? You know, I think you're a lot cooler than me. Can you define medical practitioner? Um, no. Can you count to 21? Is that your goal? Is that why you keep saying it? No. Were you adopted? <laughs> Wait, which one do you think is older? Oh, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Just in case you can hear that. And you. No, you. Who's old? Me? I'm older? Yeah. That's Wait, accurate! Wait. Congratulations! What? Name all 50 states. Can you name five states? No. I'm sorry, which one's Idaho? One of one of either that one or that one is Idaho. This is Washington. Oh, you got yeah. it. That is Washington. This is even Oregon? No. Yeah. No. Wrong way. This is Oregon. What's the one underneath Oregon? Like Seattle or something like that? What's the big red state behind you? Oh, yeah. Idaho. What? It's Idaho. So according to your level of academic knowledge, I'm you're guessing, honestly a fourth grader. I'm guessing, yeah, I was gonna say you're a fourth grader. No. Judging by your placement of Idaho. Idaho. Come on there. So my phone died, but it turned out that he was actually a seventh grader, and I knew his brother. Me and his brother are pretty good friends. We go to church together, and I go to his brother's rugby games all the time. And I don't know, it was pretty funny. And then we ended up actually talking for a while, but he was still super annoying. But, um, Maddie and I were kind of sick of him by the time it was over. So yeah, it was a lot of fun reminiscing at our school and picking on that kid. It was a really fun day and bye. So I'm at church with Maddie and the lighting is so bad. And we're both vlogging and it's really terrible, but we're at church and we just got out like half an hour ago and we've been talking and yeah, and it's been fun, so bye! So today was um, the last day at school before we had our long weekend, and during the long weekend is Valentine's Day. And so at school today, people were getting all sorts of gifts from their boyfriends and girlfriends, and it was like, oh, how cute. You're getting something from somebody that loves you, and we're not. And then at the end of the day, my mom came to school, and she dropped us off for me in the office, and there's a balloon. It's Spider-Man. Cause she said that's he's signing um i love you it's just upside down so i got spider-man and i got this box of candy and there were sweethearts and chocolates and suckers inside of it and then i also got this i'm gonna i'm not gonna pick it up but i got a flower pot and it's really cool first of all the pot is super cool it's metal and it's got like row panels and it's just super cool and then there's white and pink flowers, and I can't remember what these are called right now, and I feel so dumb. And then I got a really pretty purple hyacinth, and I think these are gonna be tulips. I'm pretty sure, pretty, pretty sure. And I also can't remember what these are called, but they're the mini version. Like, mo a lot of the times they come a lot bigger. Oh, look, it's so small. <laughs> They're small. It's super exciting. It was super cute. I left campus yesterday, and so I got called down to the office, and I was like, great, awesome, perfect. They caught me, and for some reason they cared. 
and then I got down there and then this was on the counter in the main office and I didn't even like think about it being for me and then I was like uh hey what's going on and then a bunch of the front office ladies the counselor and the security guard and the secretary and another one of the secretaries were all in the office and they were like they said this is for you and then blah 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 and I was like, who's it from? And like, yeah, some lady dropped it off. We don't know who she was. And I was like, oh, did she have long blonde hair? And then they were like, no, she had short blonde hair. And I was like, what? So I haven't seen my mom since I got home. So she might've gotten a drastic haircut. Let's go see. Oh. <laughs> we're back. Valentine's Day is the loneliest day of the year and I'm lonely on Valentine's Day. The thing is, my family, I have three brothers and nobody has a girlfriend and I don't have a boyfriend, but my mom has a boyfriend. And so my mom's boyfriend is gonna come over and we're gonna have like a feast because we're all lonely hearts, except for the two of them, but whatever, so. We have this big piece of meat that we're gonna eat, but it's like, I'll go get it. I really wish my camera was higher because I feel like I have to like. The last time we had this is for my brother's graduation. Do you see how big that is? It's like, it's really big. It's. It's only four and a half pounds, but think about the fact that it's like all meat. It doesn't have any bone in it. It seems bigger than four and a half pounds and it seems, no, it seems like four and a half pounds when I hold it. Well, it's been real and this piece of meat is bigger than my head. So, ow, got it. Well, bye. So I know I'm uploading late, but it's only my second video, so I don't really feel that bad because I just, you know, I'm not used to it yet. But I'm sorry that I'm uploading late, and I have some exciting news that you guys are going to find out about. I hope you guys had an amazing last couple days like I did, and I'll see you later. Bye!